This is it, live coverage of the 2018 Cool Fab Racing British Mini Bike Championships finalises now. This is the last race of 2018. The Mini F1 Cycars head into Turn 1 for the first time out of six. And would you believe there is no... There's a problem. Mick Williams has got a problem. He's going slowly out of turn number two, and there's a problem for Mick Williams. That, the He's same as last year. Trouble. It, the same as last year. It all went wrong in the last race of last year as well. That was at Rara. Mick Williams, I'm so glad I stopped putting, putting mortgages well, on him. Well, that's <laughs> good, because you, you don't so have one in the will, first place. We, but there was no Mick <laughs> Williams. Heads back to the paddock then, and into the complex for the first time. It means Jack Walters leads this race. Adrian Ems is the only other person to win a race in this category this season. That may well change during the course of this race. They make their way down towards the, fir the finish line for the first time. Mick Williams will not be leading, ladies and gentlemen. It's Jack Walters who leads, but all held to play in second place. It's Adrian Ems, not quite in second place, actually. It's actually Richard Davies, the one that Mark Parker normally rides. It's actually Richard Davies in second place at the moment. And more troubles for the number 111. That is Ross Morgan. You said it done one lap. Again, you've done a jinx there, Mr. It's, Giles, because it's, it's broken it, down. It's back where it started earlier on today. It's not so, gone very far again. We don't, we don't. I think, they're re I think they're remounting. They know it's all in good humour. Ross Morgan, one of the greatest characters in the paddock. But out front, never mind all that, we got a race on. Well, it's a shame there for the number one. 111 of us, Morgan. We don't delight in other people's tribulations and troubles, but they get some set about fixing that. But the race battle for the race lead is on. We don't say that in the Mini F1 sidecars too often, I'm afraid. But Jack Quarters over the line. It is leading, but second place, it's Richard Davies. Mickley looking to ride his inside line, the right side at turn one. Couldn't make it through, so quarters ahead of Davies and Lee. Then it is Simon Ibbotson in fifth place, Adrian Ems in fourth, Jason Greenstreet sixth ahead of John Hosker, Sam, this in fact, Sam Clowes ahead of John Hosker. Of course, for those of you listening online and tracks up, we have a special guest in the house. Who are you? Um, hello, um, my name is Luca Hopkins. Oh, um, hello. I'm, I'm ten year old and I'm from North Yorkshire. That's what we, I could tell you from North Yorkshire. You <laughs> talk like a North Yorkshireman. How's the all year been? You've confirmed a, I think you were fifth in the championship in the AC40 class? Yes. Class. How's that gone for you? Been good? Yeah, yeah, um, it's been a great year for me. I'll, oh, it's been a great year for me, um, seeing as I was the second highest rookie of the year, um, which, is, um, which is pretty good. Yeah, really yeah. good. You got a, your first podium of the year at Red Lodge, so that Red was also yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, did you find that good in the wet, or would you have preferred to have done it in the dry? Um, um, I do very like the wet. Okay. Yeah, I don't really like the wet. You enjoyed it yesterday yeah. then? Yeah, it was good fun. It was a good yeah. fun. What um, what what do you think of the Tatchell circuit? It only came on last year, so we've been three times there, once last year, twice this year. It's been a good track for you? Um, this is actually my favourite, um, well, um, well, one of my favourite circuits on the calendar. That's good. I'm what's sorry, what's yeah. your least favourite circuit? Uh, there isn't actually really one. Oh, okay. It's just how you... It's just how you're doing that weekend and stuff. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Really. That, that's good. We know, we're, I've, I've always noticed when you're out, you're always in the top five, top six, so you've been really consistent this year. What's the next steps moving forward? Um, next year, we're doing just the Junior LC40 Elite. Okay. And we've also got a Ovale, which is, a, which is like in between a... In, which is like in between a mini motor and a metric kit, and then we're going over to Holland to race that. You'll have to talk, learn to talk Dutch out there, though. Pardon? You'll have to learn to look, learn another language. Yeah. Double Dutch. You don't want to learn none of that. I can't talk none of that. We're back to the uh, mini F4 time, guys. We'll get back to you in a minute. Yep. Luca. Uh, Jack Walters is leading by nine tenths of a second from Mick Lee. Now, I'm not... Uh, I'm not sure how this one's going to go. I don't really want to call it, to be fair. But it's uh, very close out there at the moment. Mick Lee just getting past the traffic. He is not done yet. It's coming to the final corner. They are now. They're going to start their penultimate lap. Jack Porters leading Mick Lee. The gap is up to a second now. But not a second isn't really too much around this circuit. Because you can call that back so quickly. Running quite deep. Jack Porters through turn number one. Now, Luke, you say you're... 
you're going to be racing in, in Holland next year. You are, of course, in, in South Holland, as they call it, Lincolnshire, yes. because it is twins with that part of the world. So no wonder you like the Tashtal circuit so much. But what, what have you enjoyed about being in the Cool Fab paddock? What, what really attracts you to being here? Um, there is lots of good competition in, um, in, the, um, in Cool Fab. And also, and also, um, it's also just really fun, like, like um, racing against my friends and stuff. And you're looking forward to coming back and racing them next year, I bet. Yep, it'll be good fun. Well, right. Where do you see yourself going if you was to look at a championship in 10 years' time? What championship would you like to be in? British Superbikes, World Superbikes? Um, I'm sure, like, every rider wants to be MotoGP. Yeah. But basically, we'll see where we get. Yeah, that's a, that sounds like a good yeah. plan. Play it all by ear, as they say. We're on the last lap. Jack Walters is leading, Mick Lee is definitely still trying. It's very, very difficult out there to really judge who's it going to be. I think it's going to be Jack Walters. They're down at turn five. Would you have a go at sidecars one day, Luca? Uh, am I have been on one at Valver before? You might what? Am I have been on one ah, at okay. the Valver circuit? Do you want to on a race one? Yeah, maybe. No, maybe. You see in the future then, maybe, back in Cool Fab. We're in the last corner, really, last couple of corners, the sun is setting on Cool Fab Racing, the British Mini Bikes Championship in 2018. And it is not going to be a Mick Williams win across the line. Jack Quarters takes the final chequered flag of the year in the Mini F1 sidecars, ahead of Mick Lee in second place, Richard Davies should be third. We are waiting for him to come across the line. Richard Davies gets third and a massive pat on the back from his passenger. Adrian Ems should be fourth. We just awaited for him to come across the line. There he is. Fifth place will be Jason Greenstreet, hopefully with a passenger this time. He lost his passenger early on in the warm-up lap for race two. Coming down across the line, he is now, he's fifth. Sixth for Simon Ibbotson. Simon Ibbotson, been a podium man this year, don't forget, it's not been so the case this week and sam clouds is he seventh yes he is ahead of scott jewett and that is it as far as runners and eyes are concerned <laughs>